So hi everybody, this is Pinterest. I kind of wanted to uh, give everybody a rundown on how to refinish ball guides. You'll see here on the top is a ball guide as it came out of my Terminator 2 machine. On the bottom is a ball guide that I've regrained using Fusion 301's method that he talked about earlier in the thread. Now, I did go to Amazon. I marked these these 3M, um, and they have some, this one's a medium. They've got scotch Bright basically and sandpaper sanding wheels. I bought a medium, and I bought a, a fine. They really do a great job, uh, and you can see here, this, this rail right here looked as bad as this one did when I started. So, I'm going to enlist the, the help of my daughter here to help me uh, record this. And hopefully you can see how easy this is. I'll just show you how quickly and easily you can uh, clean up your ball guides. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clamp the uh, clamp the ball guide into the vise using my cordless drill and just going to stand on this dude using this medium unit. And if you come up here, Angela, and just get a close-up of that, you can kind of see what I'm doing. You see how quickly and easily that just regrains that ramp? Now, something that I did learn is that you never want to go out this back edge, because if you do, it'll catch on your wheel. You want to try to just drain your ball guide like this. Simple, easy. It's going to do a nice job, and I'm going to move this down a little bit just so I can get a little better grab on the uh, wheel. And continue to use your medium wheel until you get the marks out of the uh, metal. And basically all you're doing is you're sanding that metal and regraining it. I was fortunate enough, uh, one of the fellow pin siders out there, had a, uh, a new piece that I needed for my T2. Mine had a big gouge out of it. So that's what I'm doing now is just regraining this new piece that I got from him. Okay, the uh, resources here on uh, Pinsight are awesome. Okay, so you can see now, if you get a close up on that, that I've got most of the, uh, most of the lines out of that. I'm gonna turn it around, I'm gonna get this edge. Because like I said, you don't want to go off the, the leading edge. You always want to drive off the trailing edge. So I kind of hold it with my hand and get it right off the edge then. It's okay to drive it right off the edge when you're, when you're going this way. You just don't want to go off this edge. Okay. So I've got a little bit more here that I need to do. I see there's still a little bit of a line right in here. Do you see that? Yeah. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on that area a little bit more. See if I can get that out. You always want to go with the drain that you want to that you want to put back on there. It's almost out. Just a little bit more here. I can still kind of see it when I get at an angle. So I'll just hit this a little bit more now. Okay, so that's the first step. Now the next step, just throw this fine version in, put it in, and we'll run this fine over it. That'll touch it up a little bit more and make it a little bit cleaner. And so if, if you, you see, see here now, I've got a pretty nice grain pattern going on. There is a little bit, you can see right in here, there's just a little bit that I'm still seeing, a little bit of a line there. If you get it in the right light, but I can take that out right now. So let me work on that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move this down a little bit more so that I can get this edge a little better. A little bit bigger vise would help. I bought this little cheapy vise at Harbor Freight, but it tends to do the job for the little bit of stuff I have to do. And 
and wipe it off a little bit. But you can see that graining is pretty nice. Now, not quite all the way done because I see that I've not kept it straight. Which is okay. If you get off a little bit, you just go back and re it a little bit more and you'll smooth it right out. So, not to worry. And you can see that looks like a brand new ball guide. Nice and shiny. Easy to do and fast.